Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Eric Burns. I am the campus principal of C.C. Hardy Elementary, and I am here today to announce your district MVP straight out of the first grade hallway, Mrs. DeBrock. This is first grade collaborative team time, right? Enjoy. <laughs> hey, here's the thing. Y'all have done this before. You know what you're doing. Uh, pay no attention to the camera. Let's just rock and roll. It made me look good. All right. Go ahead. All right. First grade norms. Phones on silent is our data for our CFA which is which is what we've been talking about with all of our uh, comprehension skills is they can tell you what they are thinking but they have a hard time like justifying why they think that Gay you're like in. what like a I, I'm talking what? you're like just like a <laughs> what like a no. AMVP teacher or something no I decided because I went back to the beginning we talked this what I did with the the graphic organizer right. for the graphing piece. Yep, and so I didn't even do that. I mean, it. you like have MVP kids or something? No, I think it just like on Liz, Thursday. Liz, I. What are you like? Some MVP teacher? I'm gonna give the crown oh, to geez. you. Thank you. I'm sorry. Woo! for three years together and she's absolutely fantastic. She always has a smile on her face and the kids are always involved and listening and working really hard in our small group. I became a teacher because I want to make a difference in the world and I believe the best way for me to do that is to impact each child that I can because the future of the world truly is in my classroom. Do I have now? Who has an idea of how I could solve this? Scarlet. Okay, and then color in eight. My personal philosophy about teaching is that each child is unique and different, and it's my job to create a unique and different path for each of them that begins where they are and then leads them where they need to go. I want my students to remember that they were safe and they were loved in my classroom. Of course, I want them to remember the things that we learned, but more importantly, I want them to remember the relationships that they had with me and with each other because that truly is the best kind of learning. That's okay. Um, let's see, who can help out? Back end, do you remember what this is called? 67. It is 67. What I love most about Mrs. DeBrock is that even though her title says, I am a first grade teacher at C.C. Hardy Elementary, she realizes that all of our students are at different levels in their learning. So she has some students who are advanced, and she also has some students who are below first grade level. She differentiates her instruction to meet those kids and to accommodate them and to meet them where they're at. So that's one of the things that I really love about Mrs. DeBrock. She is an amazing teacher, and I promise you this, I promise you, write it down, put your money on it, she is going to be one of the greatest of all time. They're not here to uh, here record your collaborative team time. Okay. They're actually here to record our December MVP for Willis ISD, Mrs. DeBrock. Thank you very much, I'm so honored. No, I have no idea. I've been pumped.